This is an air run on a Dahl company somewhere pre-1920 dual steam engine, dual flywheels, dual cylinders. Everything's original including the uh, spirit can. Um, there is a couple items that need to be replaced, one of them being the water pump piston. Other than that, uh, the photos will demonstrate everything else. And uh, everything seems to be fully operational. It's a larger version than the 512 model. And uh, here we go. There's a whistle. You'll see the connecting rod on the water pump on the back flywheel just rotating freely. Starts and stops nice. As you can see there. Go from a stop to a start. There's the horn. As you'll see on the uh, photos, it's larger than the 512. It's got five of the vent holes. Well, since the original chimney does come off here. Very well conditioned. The weight is still there for the safety valve. As we look around to the other side, a couple of the items that I can show you that are needing to be replaced or machined or as the piston has the threading for the connecting arm but you need a piston for the water pump this is affixed uh, via bolts and a nut through the inside a handle the wood has been missing on the valve the glass is intact the whistle fully operational and on the wood it's just slightly worn from the heat there's a missing oil cup and I believe you'll need an additional oil cup plug there for the piston everything looks fully operational there I haven't run it on Spirit, but there's the original burner. It's great condition. I didn't test it for leaks, but it should be should be fine. It reads Dahl Company. I believe it's a number two five or two six inside. The boiler still got the original finish. You will see paint of the original red color inside, blue on the the main portions there. The flywheels do have some color remaining, a lot of dirt and grime. You see the red trim. There's a blue pinstripe that's faded. Solid bluish base that can be cleaned out. Underneath, very solid and heavy. A lot of the remnants of the blue. Still the solid cast. Original screws throughout. 
and uh, like I said, it hasn't been steam fired by myself. Would love to, but finances are calling. You have the original doll company emblem. Anyway, this concludes the uh, tour of this dual cylinder, dual flywheel steam engine from Dole Company. My best estimates are pre-1917. Um, from there I'm not too sure how many years before that it could have been uh, built.